Mr. President, I rise in support of my amendment, which would prevent taxpayer dollars from going towards economic impact payments for prisoners. You may not realize it, but the first $1,200 checks we went went to every inmate in the United States. And I'm thinking, that can't be right. And I'm told it was a drafting error. Well, then we sent out the last check, and I said, we got to stop this. And I was told that there were those who wished that those checks go to inmates. When my constituents hear about that, they think it's a total example of how Congress is incontinent in spending money. <laughs> now, prisoners do not contribute to the tax base. Taxpayers are already paying the entirety of their, of their care, and they cannot reasonably stimulate the economy, and still they are eligible for stimulus checks. I the Senate will be in order. I argue that all spending on COVID relief must be targeted towards real needs. This is a perfect example of untargeted, inappropriate spending. I ask that my colleagues support this common sense amendment.